Good morning, everyone. Almost good afternoon because we are here for lunch at one of our favorite local restaurants, well, semi-local, Hershey Park's Chocolatier. We are here with our friends Chad and Vanessa from Two Tickets to Adventure and a brand new friend, Chris the Girl, from Chris the Girl. So we're super excited and we're super hungry. Anything to add? Just that we miss our friends Sam and Jay. We do. The theme park foodies are no longer Hershey locals, so we are covering this base for them. Sam and Jay, we miss you dearly. We will eat in your honor. I'm Tim. I'm Katie. And we do things like this. So we are meeting Chris the girl for the first time here. Hello. Chad and Vanessa are big fans and have told us many great things about you. That's good. Would you They're like to tell true. us about your channel? Um, yeah, so it's Chris the girl, as you said, um, and I do all kinds of things from, oh geez, from theme parks to uh, traveling to national parks to gardens and arboretum. I do literally like everything. It's kind of more so just the different adventures. I saw you were at Dutch Wonderland the other day. I sure was, yeah, <laughs> last Sunday. We have yet to go, oh so that's gosh, on our bucket list. It is so much fun. It is really fun, like it's really, really fun. And then of course, if you've been on our channel for a while, you know Chad and Vanessa. They are regular commenters and we have collabed with them only one time, but hoping for more in the future. You guys want to tell us a little bit about Two Tickets to Adventure? Yep, so as Tim said, we are Two Tickets to Adventure. We are foodies, we are travelers, we are theme park coaster enthusiasts, and we are adventurers. Uh, we like to go all over the place, and we will continue to go many places. Wherever we're going. We are happy to be able to be here with Tim and Katie and Chris the girls. Today. Yes, we strong-armed everyone into coming to the Chocolatier this morning. All right, so Katie has gone ahead and ordered one of the new mocktails. Tell me about this mocktail, Katie. This is the Lavender Fizz. Lavender lemonade with Sierra Mist, soda water, and mint, which literally sounds like my dream. Yeah, I got more of, ooh, ooh, ooh. that's really good. You definitely need to get a little stir to get the lavender. And Chad got himself a Laugh Track Lemonade, Blue Raspberry Lemonade with Crushed Jolly Rancher Candy, which, to be honest, looks like Fruity Pebbles to me. I don't know how they crushed these up. I don't know what I expected, but it wasn't that. <laughs> Doesn't know his own strength. <laughs> That is literally what it is. It's like liquid candy. It's good. That's so sweet. That's a no for me. <laughs> As she takes another sip. Maybe sipping it off the top. It's a really good flavor. Like a less sweet maybe. I don't know. Food has arrived and I got myself this new item. The Reese's Take 5 Chicken Sandwich. Not a lot of new entrees on the menu today, but this was one of them. And this is Reese's Peanut Butter and Jalapeno Caramel Grilled Chicken. Hershey's chocolate drizzled house bacon, leaf lettuce on a pretzel roll. Let's peer inside, and see what we're looking at. Maybe underneath the lettuce. Oh my goodness. <laughs> did you see how thick the bacon is over yes, here? Yes, I did. But the camera doesn't. There it is. And Katie got the grilled chicken and strawberry salad. I'm honestly not sure if this is new or not, but I wanted something lighter. I feel like it's not, but we might not have had I've it. I've never had it, so it's new to me. I think it's pretty self-explanatory, though. Yeah, it's chicken, strawberries, onions. You got a couple different kinds of tomatoes in here. Oh, it's just heirloom tomatoes, but they're mini tomatoes. It looks delicious. Chad and Vanessa got themselves a spring garden flatbread, whipped ricotta, tasso ham, asparagus, grilled onions, and Hershey's chocolate balsamic glaze. We've had that glaze before, so we know that part is good. I'm cutting this in half so that it's easier to consume. Because I want to get as much of it in my mouth as possible. The pretzels, needed a sharp knife yeah, the pretzel is kind of tough to cut through. So bacon. this is this is bacon. Look at this thickness of this bacon. They cut bacon and, and the this chicken. is the chicken, and it's drizzled with the Hershey's glaze. I don't know where the Reese's is. I think it's in the glaze. It's, oh, right here. It's in the butter. Reese's butter glaze. Yeah. I wonder if it's good. Really, really good. 
Whereas I couldn't see the peanut butter, I definitely I taste, taste it. it. Here it comes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Oh, the cake is so pretty. Right, this one is the take five. Five. Oh my god. And then we have the cupcake fusion. Well, that one looks like it's gonna be my fave. Quick, Katie, tell me what they are. Reese's Cup Fusion Cheesecake. Oh, it looks so good. This is the take five. That Reese's one I know. Take five cake. Pinwheel cake. And the and rapidly melting peach, peach, milk peach milkshake. milkshake. It started melting the second it hit the table. We are on a ticking clock. Yeah, Hershey, we yeah. need to have a talk about it's scale. I don't see the one what is I this chaos? Done. This this one is gonna need some cups, I think, because it's it's out of control. Yeah. We just, it's we all the way down there. Go, I guess. What are you trying? I just had the take five cake and take take five is an underrated candy. It is. I did not like the jelly thing from the take five. No? I don't know what it was. I, I gotta taste it again. It's an accent. It like, more, jello? What it is tastes it? like more peanut butter to me though. Yeah. Uh. I tried whatever the heck that is. That's the Reese's cheesecake. And that's all. That is really, really good. Excellent. Well done. The Thank cheesecake you. has redeemed itself. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Have you guys had the pinwheel cake? I see Chad is having it right now. What do we think? It's good, so it's a little bit messy. I'm not sure if the layers of the cake are actually flavored, but it does have those um, Jolly Rancher things that were in my drink okay. on it and in it too. So you actually are getting the pieces of Jolly Ranchers in the pinwheel cake. So that gives the flavor. It's good. Otherwise, it's a nice uh, soft cake, vanilla cake with vanilla icing. Sweet. Now I don't have to order the mocktail and I can still get the Jolly Rancher experience. Yep. This yeah. This is going to destroy some of the artistic flair of the cup, of the uh, milkshake, but... I wonder if pouring it would be easier. It might be after I take the top layer off. First proper taste of the summer beach milkshake. Well, I didn't actually get any of the summer beach <laughs> milkshake in there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's good. There's way too much milkshake for one person though, I'm glad we have help. I put a mic of the peach cobbler topper on my plate, because Chad said it was better than the actual shake. If you're wrong about that, Chad, then I'm afraid we can't hang out anymore. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know if it's You're wrong. Peach coffee bar. Eh. You're about the same. They're both good in their own way. We, okay. we got our first no what on the take five. What is that? What is that? The jelly thing, right? Yep. That doesn't belong there. <laughs> that has no business being there. Why is it here? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what did I just eat? <laughs> it's gelatin. gelatin. Oh my god. We need an answer to what this thing is. I seriously do. Let me know in the comments below. <laughs> This is the Reese's cheesecake, right? Yeah. While I re wear the Reese's shirt. Woo! <laughs> that was so. <laughs> not, yeah. It's not exactly a, uh, a masterpiece, but man, it tastes good. There was no doubt in my mind that one was gonna be good, and it is. Rich, though. Oh well, there's no way you could eat a whole one. Of I those. mean, that pretty much everything that comes. Not this big. I don't even think Chim and I could have shared that alone. I'm trying to finish the caramel thing. It's not. <laughs> Right. Well, the nice thing about it is, is it does, you can literally take it right off the layers. Yeah. yeah. True. This is so. take five, so now it's a take four. <laughs> there you go. Behold the graveyard. We did good, guys. We did good. We get a lot of questions about what the damage is of the chocolatier typically. The desserts are not cheap. But, if you're a season pass holder, you'll always get 15% off here. Sometimes more, depending on the season, so it's worth it to come out. Alright everyone, that's gonna wrap up our time at the Chocolatier. We had many, many, many new desserts today. What was everyone's favorite? Reese's Cheesecake! Wow. That was the crowd pleaser. That was a quick, quick answer from pretty much everyone. What was our least favorite? This will be... Whatever that caramel layer thing Just 
the caramel layer. The caramel layer of the take five. Yeah. yeah. Everything it's a, else about it was fine. It's a beautiful looking piece of cake, but it is that caramel layer just doesn't sit well with most people. Most these people, us people, but. If you like caramel, you might love it. It's always gelatin worth form. in yeah. gelatin <laughs> form. <laughs> always worth coming out to the chocolatier to see what's new because their menu is evolving all the time, and it's great to come here with friends that can help you eat through all the new stuff. Thank you guys for joining us today again. Chad and Vanessa from Two Tickets to Adventure. Chris the girl from Chris the girl. Lovely to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you guys too. It's great to eat with you. Yes. And we of course are Tim and Katie, and every day is a new, new adventure. adventure. We will see you next time. Bye guys. Food coma.